Hello my Hello Kitty fans, this is Hello Gabius and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, welcome to my channel. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that bell notification and like this video. In today's video, I am so excited. I just received this item today and I got the Moon Hello Kitty Electric Toothbrush. So this is what I got. I did unbox it, posted the video on TikTok and I want to show you exactly what this package looks like because I am just so excited. I haven't opened the actual box itself. The plastic wrapping is still on it. Um, I, I'm just, I just can't wait. Far as the packaging, everything was well packaged and I did get my packing slip and of course I did order three items. Now, as far as what I paid for everything that I'm gonna show you today, I paid a total of $93.48. And that was with a 15% uh, discount. So the total would have been, I think like 107, $109. But this is my packing slip. I only ordered three items. And so of course the main item is the toothbrush. So you know me, I love packages from Hello Kitty. And this is definitely a key keepsake for me and I love that they also have it uh, plastic wrapped so uh, because I like to keep my packages now as far as this company um, some of these companies I I have no clue that they even exist until they actually make a Hello Kitty collaboration and so um, I don't know anything about the company Moon all I know is that now they're making Hello Kitty electric, electric toothbrushes so cool I'm a fan now so this is the beautiful gorgeous box and I do love when there's like attention to detail even on the packaging the box itself is nice a satin touch but the actual graphic of Hello Kitty and the toothbrush is very glossy and I love that I mean I can see myself putting this on my wall if you know my channel you know that I like to pretty much put everything on my wall as decoration so so anyways this is just like a, I already have a sonic electric toothbrush um, and it has the different modes just like the sonic electric toothbrush would have and um, so this is supposed to be like red and white um, and so here and it tells you everything that's included so we should have an easy grip uh, one brush head black bristle one brush head white bristle one usb charger and then a travel case which i am so excited because my husband and i do travel a lot and i can't wait to take this on the road with me so, so let's go ahead and get started so now so this is the box and this is the case that they were talking about and let's see so it is a hard plastic and you do see the Sanrio 2024 name there you do see the name moon and you do see Hello Kitty on the case and so what else you get on this case instruction manual you get the plug-in for the USB and then you get the base to where to rest the toothbrush on your uh, bathroom counters okay pretty basic so because I've said that I already have a sonic uh, electric toothbrush I'm kind of doing like a mental comparison this is very light very cheap plastic I could already tell just by the feel of it so the sonic toothbrush uh, bases are a lot heavier and more to have your toothbrush more stable on your bathroom counter so just a quick thought there now I'm gonna open up the case and whoa it's hard to open up this case okay Whew, there we go and look at how beautiful this is so it does say moon hello kitty I love that um, and then you do have the white bristle toothbrush 
and then the one with the black bristle you do get the handle here so as far as the handle it's not that heavy it doesn't have like a good weight to it like again i'm comparing it to my sonic uh toothbrush um i love that there is hello kitty here at the bottom button is red you do see the name moon back here you do also see the certification for sanrio here at the bottom as well and that's pretty cool and so it will just basically go on the base here that is how you will put that on there unfortunately it would uh cut it cuts off the hello kitty name which is not a big deal because um you do want it to charge and that's fine so i um, don't know if it has any power in it right now Ooh. So right now it's in massage. Then it's sensitive. This is clean. Polish. Ooh, so it, it sounds very nice. Um, and um, so this is how it is. So you do see that the little battery light is down here to know if you have enough battery now. So I do like to charge my toothbrush as soon as I'm done with it, I, it's charged. So it is always, always charged for sure. Unless I'm traveling that I will take about seven days before I charge my Sonic electric toothbrush. So it'll be interesting to see how long the battery will last on this one. So uh, as far as the rest, so now I'm planning on using the white bristle uh, head first and I do like these covers that it comes with and then it's just a typical toothbrush it's not too big it's not too small it does uh, feel very cheap just so you know um, but you know as long as it gets the job done so you put it here and then I'm not sure if you can see the okay cool so then um that is the electric toothbrush and i am just so excited and it looks like you can easily wipe it easy to clean that is awesome now i'm trying to take off the bristle head here so to open, to open this case is very difficult, I have found. Um, to open it back up, it, it just takes a lot to open. Like, ah, can't even open it. I feel like if I had long nails, I would break a nail for sure. So, okay, so that is the case here with the electric toothbrush. Now, as far as the other items I got, I also got the toothpaste. So it did come in a combo. You get the electric toothbrush and the toothpaste, the strawberry toothpaste together. And that is like one set, or you can just get them individually, the toothbrush individually, the toothpaste individually. And so it just depends on how you wanna buy it. So you do save a little bit more if you buy them together, which is what I did. Okay, so now this is the strawberry toothpaste and it says that it's strawberry mint. Um, one thing I did notice, so they're making it cruelty free and vegan. And so they're free of a lot of the artificial things that you will normally put, I'm assuming, in a toothpaste. But I did see though that online there is no fluoride. On the website, it did say fluoride free because it's vegan. I didn't like that very much. Of course, since a kid, we're instilled in us that every toothpaste that we use needs to have fluoride. Um, and I'm assuming that that's probably why I don't see in ADA uh, approval. I took a quick snippet online at the healthymouth.org or the ADA.org and it tells you how to choose a good toothpaste and it's telling you here about the importance of using fluoride.
and I'll put the link down below. General terms though, picking out a toothpaste that has fluoride in it and the American Dental Association seal of acceptance to make sure that it's been independently tested for safety and effectiveness is extremely important. So let's go ahead and open this up. And let me just say, so here it says you can never have too many smiles. So cute. Again, I love the attention to detail on the packaging. So this is a big toothpaste. And I thought this was, I mean, you could easily mistake this for a lotion because that's just how big it is. So it's a 4.2 ounce. So if you're going to be traveling with it, it's going to be too big. It's more than three ounces if you want to go through security line at the airport, just so you know. Um, and so let, opening it up, it does have a security seal, which is great. It doesn't smell like strawberry to me. So this is what it looks like. Um, it, it looks like strawberry yogurt. That's what it looks like. But it doesn't uh, necessarily smell like strawberry. Wow. So I did taste it a little bit. It tastes like um, like candy. It tastes like candy. It doesn't really taste much like mint. Uh, nevertheless, um, it does have like a little cooling feeling. Um, and it doesn't taste bad. It actually tastes good. I kind of want to eat it, like just pour some in my mouth. But that's good. So that, that is good that it has a good flavor. So that is the toothpaste. And they give you a lot. So like a real full size toothpaste. Okay, and so lastly, I did order the toothbrush refills. And of course, these were extra and I did want to make sure that I got them in red and that's why there is a dot there and i believe you get a white one white crystal and black crystal uh heads so let's see and you do so this is just like the ones that are here in the case you have a white bristle and a black bristle so i'm set for the year i would say Okay, I'm in my bathroom and I'm going to plug it in just to see what it looks like when you plug it in. So I do like that they do include the outlet adapter. You don't have to try to get one from like your Apple phone or something. So it is USB. And then, so the base is very light though, but so then you put your toothbrush here and so it does start to light up that it's charging. So cool. So here is my new toothbrush in my bathroom. This is the total unboxing of the Moon Hello Kitty electric toothbrush. Uh, let me know what you think and let me know would you spend almost $100 for your electric toothbrush. So I'm already used to spending that much because again, I own the Philips Sonic electric toothbrush already. So. This is just so cute, guys. I had to get it with Hello Kitty. Come on. Definitely love the pairing and I love the packaging. So let me know what you think about the new Moon Hello Kitty electric toothbrush. I want to thank you for watching my videos. Please comment, like, and subscribe.